How's it going, everyone? It is Prashan here, and we're going over all the variants that are dropping this week in Marvel Snap. I did not have time to edit the way I normally edit my videos. It was a busy week. We just had the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl just ended, so I'm actually late making this video. So we're doing it this way. Low production. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> Next week, I'll do better, I swear. But... We have the first variant uh, that drops uh, on the 11th here, and it's this Kazar variant. I recently just purchased this in the shop. Um, the art is by Ryan Kennard. Uh, oh, well, the colorist is Ryan Kennard, and then the art artist is Joe Vereen, if I'm saying it right. Um, yeah, this art is pretty cool. I'm going to have to move myself. That way I'm not in the way. That way you guys can see the art. So we'll do this. There we go. I moved. <laughs> All this is in real time. Um, yeah, so pretty cool Gazar variant. First time I'm seeing a Venomized Gazar. Obviously, it's going to be the only one. But this was a must cop for me. Um, this will probably be my, my go-to for the most part. Um, yeah, so Gazar, February 11th, super rare, so 1,200 gold. Um, let's see what else comes out. So we got February 11th and then February 13th. We have the Stan Hip, Agent Coulson, uh, the Thanos Infinity Gauntlet, Squirrel Girl, a bunch of Dan Hips, huh? Dan Hip, Squirrel Girl, uh, Dan Hip, X-23, and then you got your in Hulk Lee, Cole Obsidian, uh, and then this Eduardo Francisco Nimrod and the Dan Hip Electra. I swear... I thought I already had the Stan Hip Electra, but maybe I don't have her already. I swear, I thought I did. Maybe I don't. But this Nimrod will be the one I I really like. This Nimrod because I don't I don't think Nimrod has any good solid variants. Too bad it's going to be in the spotlight catch, and I'm super low on resources. But he's going to be in the spotlight catch. All the others. Well, all, obviously, uh, this Cole Sodian, he's going to be in the spotlight catch as well. I don't know. I don't think it's really worth getting him in the spotlight, but I really don't like having the basic variant, um, the basic art um, when it comes to having cards. I really like to be different. So I might go after him, or if I get him, I won't be mad. Um, and then what else drops? Yeah, and this Thanos is the truth. I think... Everyone's going to go after this Thanos. Like, I don't I, I sort of want to make a Thanos Galactus deck just because, just so I could play both of these uh, variants together. I think that would be super cool. So all my spotlights, all my resources are going to go towards this card here because this is the one I want the most. Um, of course, Series 5. I might even make another Thanos deck because I know a lot of you might not have Thanos and you guys might want to try them out. And then uh, February 14th, we have this Valentine's Day uh, bundle. Um, let's see here. Bundle, so is Spider-Man grounded. So you have this Ghost Spider. Uh, let's look how much it is. $49. Ugh. That's a lot, man. That's a lot. But um, you do get 6,500 gold. And I think whenever you get gold and tokens in a bundle, I think it's worth it because you can use those resources for something else um i don't know the bundle value is 217 percent which is pretty good the currency value is 163 percent which is pretty good but i don't know 40 50 bucks is a lot man like it, they just had the the uh, magic and um what's his name why am i forgetting his name the sorcerer supreme dr strange the Magic Doctor Strange bundle, that one was pretty expensive. And you had like the, I don't know, the Ironheart bundle. And then you had the uh, Sarah bundle. I don't know. It, it's a lot, man. It's a lot. So I, I do understand people like picking and choosing and why you guys want these bundles data mined. Because obviously, like, I, you have to spend your resources wisely, especially if you don't know about this stuff. Let's check out this Miles Morales. It's pretty cool. I don't know. There, there's better Miles Morales uh, variants, in my opinion, but I, I don't know. I, I think it'll be cool to have. 
So let's see what else is as dropping. So we have this Magneto Quiet Council. Oh, this is fire. This is fire. So this is going to be a part of a bundle two magnets. How do they work? 99. Oh my goodness, man. $99. Ah, just for a thousand gold. But you get, I don't know, you get 10,000 collector's tokens. I don't know, man. I, this is insane. Okay. They want me to spend a hundred. I don't know, 150 bucks for three variants. I, I don't know, man. I, I think this might be a skip for me. Like I, I, like I really like the card, but 100 bucks is too too expensive for me. I think I, I think I might go with the Valentine's Day because it gives you more gold. Uh, the bundle value is 221 percent currency value 203, so it's a good value. It's just expensive, man. Super expensive. And then you get the avatar, the title, the tokens, the gold, and the Magneto boosters. But awesome, awesome variant. I think it's a pretty cool variant. Especially if you're into comic books like I am. The Quiet Council and all that. Like, perfect. Uh, let's see what else is dropping this week. Uh, let's see here. So we got this Thing variant, which is pretty cool. I think this is the best Thing variant by far. Um, the artist is Scott Collins, and it's crazy too because it's like there's bird poop on the thing. This is freaking awesome, and he has like a lollipop. I don't know. I I think this is the best one. I'm gonna be going after this one, or try to. Hopefully, I have enough gold, but I think this is the best one. I'll probably try to split it as much as I can. Um, let's see what else drops that day. We have the Juggernaut here. Eh, it's all right. It's gonna be in the rare pool. Uh, so only 700 gold. Artist is Marco D. Alfonso. It's okay. I think it's all right. I don't know. I wouldn't be mad if I if I got it, but I, I wouldn't go for this one. I would rather go for that thing. The thing, that one is the, the new hotness. And I think that's it as far as uh, what drops this week, right? Yeah, I think that's it. And then obviously, we have the spotlights that are dropping this week. Um, let's go back up and look at them. That way you guys know. So, obviously, we have Coal Obsidian, Nimrod, Thanos, and then this Coal Obsidian variant. So, I'm pretty much going to use tokens to get Coal Obsidian. Um, that will be my route. And then I'll use my keys. I really want the Thanos variant. But if I get the Nimrod one, I won't be mad. If I get the Cole, I won't be mad. So I wouldn't be mad if I got a variant for any of these cards. But with my luck, I would end up getting tokens, a thousand tokens, because that's what's been happening with my spotlight keys. The first one for the past few weeks have been tokens. I haven't got a card or anything. It's always a card I already have. So, yeah, I think that's that's pretty much it for this week as far as variants. I know... Short video, low production. I'm sorry. You guys can kill me for it. I think my, well, to be transparent, I think my last one got, like, the most dislikes. I think I, it's because I'm fooling people uh, that I actually have the variants. So I, I don't know. Or maybe it's just me. I'm not sure. Um, but if you guys want me to do it like this, let me know in the comments. If you want me to do it the old way, let me know in the comments. And that's that's pretty much it. Just a quick variance. Look at the variance this week. Till next week, guys. Peace.